What problem was that number eight? That. Good. Okay. An appraiser is evaluating a subject property with 1,500 square feet, two baths, fireplace, a one-car garage, located a comp that sold for 160. Uh, assuming construction costs are 50 per square foot, value of a full bath 2,500, half bath 1,500. Fireplace is uh, uh, three grand, single garage is 7,000. Appraiser notes that properties in the area appreciated 2% since the date of sale. What is the indicated value of the subject property? Now note that what we've done in this particular case is we just took everything that was given to us and we organized it. I would highly recommend that you be organized when you're taking this on the uh, exam. The subject property has these following amenities which we just read. I directly line up the comp beside it. The comp, we know what it's sold for because it is a closed sale, so we have that. Um, in regards to the adjustments, remember you're adjusting only for the differences. So. I line up the comps amenities, 1550 bath and a half, full uh, uh, fireplace, no garage, and the appreciation, uh, as I suggested in class, if you would just simply take the comps and put in your plus or minuses. The comp, uh, in regards to square footage, is superior to the subject property, so we subtract it. It's inferior in regards to baths, inferior increase, fireplace, no change. In regards to the garage, uh, the comp does not have a garage, so it is uh, inferior to the subject property, inferior increase. Appreciation is always a plus adjustment. Now when you go back and start making these adjustments, remember, only adjust for the differences. The difference of 15, between 1550 and, uh, and 1500 square feet is uh, 50 square feet times $50 per square foot. It's where we got our 2500. Okay, caution right here. This is usually the mistake that people are going to make on the exam. On the baths, what I suggest that you do is create a value for the baths. For example, two baths has a value of $5,000. Why $5,000? Because two times 2,500 is 5,000. A bath and a half has 2,500 plus $1,500. 25 for the full, 15 for the half, which has a value, a contribution value of $4,000. The difference between 5,000 and 4,000, of course, is 1,000. But put a star beside that and please note, that if you had just simply taken the half bath value that was given to you, you would have been off by $500. Fireplace, no adjustment. Single car garage, simple enough. Just plug in the number. Put another star beside appreciation. This is the most likely mistake, or the second most likely mistake that people will make. Notice that this appreciation is 2% since the date of sale. The comp sold by 160. In theory, it would have appreciated by 3,200, 160 times 2%. Appreciation is always a plus adjustment. Once you have everything plugged into place, just follow the signs, and ultimately 168.7 is the indicated value of the subject property using just that one comp.